Well, I'm with a third pride, and uh, only one lioness is visible, but it is quite thick here. And uh, it is part of the Mara River pride, and uh, they've swum across from the Paradise Plain on the other side. And uh, for those of you who remember the last of our TV shows, uh, it was this pride that was chasing uh, the two cheetah sisters. Um, Amani's daughters, if I remember correctly. It's Amani's daughters. And um, it was this pride that was chasing them. Now, she's very fat, and there's probably a few more hidden in this long grass somewhere. And I think they've had a meal around here. And the reason I think that, apart from her ob 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 oh, obese belly, is uh, the fact that there is a battalier sitting in the tree above and uh, often the first on the kills and we're waiting for the lions to move off so it can take advantage of uh, the scraps that remain. Uh, definitely worth coming to have a look here this afternoon as it gets a bit later because uh, there could be some movement in this area. This is, this is a very big pride. As I said, we only can see one lioness at the moment, but it is quite a big pride. There could be a lot more, so they could still be hungry. And it looks like she's disappeared into the grass. There she is. Hello, pretty lady. giving herself a good groom before she decides to plonk over. I don't think she's going to move too far during the day today. Eduardo is wondering, which pride of lions do we run into the most? Well, Eduardo, it all depends on which area we're working. Um, if we're staying in the north of the triangle, uh, the Angama pride is uh, the most common. Um, around the crossings, the Paradise pride. And around this area, uh, the Mara River pride or the Magoro pride a little bit further south. Um, if you're up against the escarpment, the Sausage Tree pride. And then down south near the Tanzanian border, the Salt Lake pride. And then, of course, when you go across to the other side of the river, Sala's pride, Ronga pride, um, Purungat pride. So it all depends on the area that we, we're in. So there are many, many lines and it uh, depends where we're working. So we're lucky enough to spend lots of time with lots of different prides. And, and that's what makes one of these, uh, coming on these live safaris so exciting. We do get to get, get to know many different prides um, over the time we spend with them. She's looking quite lazy and hiding in the long grass, so I think we're going to skedaddle on um, and see what else we can find.